What's up booktube? I'm you and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm filming on my cell phone and also I'm not going to edit this because I'm having problems with my editing software. So yay! So today I will be unboxing the bookcase. Um, it's just so that this is really awkward. Like I don't know how to position this. I don't have a tripod <laughs> for my phone. So okay. So the bookcase is a South African subscription box for books, obviously for bookish things. So it's basically like owl crate and such <laughs> and boxes like those. I'm really bad with words. So this is really weird for me to not be able to edit this. <laughs> um, this is not sponsored. I just bought the box and I thought it would be cool to unbox it since I really don't have any content anymore and I'm really creatively drained <laughs> because um, the photography course I'm doing is really draining my creativity. So. <laughs> Yeah, I'm having problems, but anyway, no excuses. I'm sorry. Um, so let's let's do this. I'm I'm so excited. Like I can't even contain my excitement right now um, because it is a. <laughs> I can't speak. I'm so excited. I can't speak. It's a subscription box from South Africa. Like <sighs> I don't have to wait three months. So on. The box it has a sticker that says the red riding hood i don't know why it's probably like like the theme or something i don't know this is the january box i think yeah i bought it at the end of january so it's either i think it's a january box but we'll see when we open it um so it's the title and then on the side it says spread literally i can't speak english that word, love. So, oh, let's open it. I'm really bad at opening things. Also, the packaging that it came in said fragile, so I'm really, really nervous and excited because everything I get that's fragile, I usually break. So I really hope I don't break this. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's um, so first thing I see is a card and it says Delightfully Dark Tales, um, if you can see that. Okay, I'm not gonna read this because it's basically everything that's in this. So I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna read the spoilers, I'm just gonna, um, I'm sorry, I've really, uh, I haven't done an unboxing or anything in so long, I can't remember how to do this. <laughs> Okay, so the first thing I see, just put that out, is a jar. I'm gonna play with the bubble wrap more than these actual things. I love bubble wrap so much. Alright. This makes my heart happy. Anyway, sorry. So, this is, oh, this is so pretty. Look at that. It's so cute. It says, and at last I see the light. Oh, I can't. Um, so, I assume. Oh, so it's like one of those electric candles. It looks like a candle, but it, it's not. So it's like a little lantern thingy. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, now I understand. Like the illustration on it, it's Rapunzel and oh, Rapun Rapunzel and Flynn on the on the boat thingy with the lanterns. Oh, this is adorable. Oh, I love this. Wait, where is it from? Um. It's from Paper Cute. It's really cute though, and it's full of glitter. Oh, this is so cute. I'm really, I'm really scared I'm gonna break this. <laughs> okay, so then we have a lot of this, which 
most likely I'm gonna play with later. Um, usually when I get stuff like this I use it for like DIY arts and crafts later so I'm gonna use it. And also this make is perfect for perfect for gifts so the more you know um, you know, always try to be green try to recycle I usually do this do it with this prescription thing so tip of the day pro tip Ooh. Oh, so I see a little box um, I'm I'm really messing up my room now. Okay, so it's like a little black box with red-ish lid, I don't know. And it says, let the story come alive, open me on page 169. Okay, so I can't open this, I have to open it when I read the book. So that's, that's exciting. So it's basically Christmas then, it's like the book is giving me gifts. <laughs> that's so cute, I can't. Then I have this. I'm really scared it's something I can break because I don't want to break it. But look how cute this is. Like I love stamps so much and I really don't wanna I don't wanna like rip it or anything. Also the paper is super cute, so I don't wanna mess this up. Like I can use it for something. It's really cute. Okay, so it's a little bag. So cute. Okay, I'm sorry for the dogs. I really can't control them. Okay, so it says fairy tale sterling silver charm bracelet, and it's in such a cute. Oh, look how cute this is. Well, I'm gonna open it. Oh my gosh, it's adorable, and it's also on the cork thingy, so you can take it off. I think. Yeah. So it has an apple for um, Snow White, it has a deer, it has a leaf, a key, a sword, and a, what do you call it, a tea, teapot, it's a teapot, and a castle. This is so cute, like, I'm, I didn't even think I'll wear it because I really don't want to like lose the charm. Because it's so adorable. Ah, go back, go back, go back. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, let me just check where it's from. Where did I put them? Oh, there it is, sorry. So the bracelet... It's, it just says, The ultimate fairy tale charm bracelet made especially for you by us. So I, it, it's probably made by the bookcase people <laughs> I know it's really adorable and I'm really sorry for being this awkward I'm just really not used to like unboxings and hauls and things anymore <laughs> so I'm really nervous <laughs> um, next oh my gosh it's so cute. the next one I have is a clay cloud creation um, bookmark and it has little cat paws and cat legs so let me just get a book so when you're reading so when you're reading and you use the bookmark it has cute little legs oh, it's so cute. like i've seen things like this on etsy um but i've never actually bought myself one i wanted to but um obviously the shipping from wherever the store is I'm full of glitter and things so I'm allergic um, the shipping takes forever so I don't buy stuff anymore from Etsy like me and my sister had a store on Etsy but yeah shipping so this is um, oh it's a wolf sorry it's not a cat the big bad wolf bookmark inspired by little red riding hood exclusively made for the bookcase by Clay Cloud Creations. So, oh, this is so cute. Like, oh, next, it's new, um, it's a new addition to my, my bookmark collection. So I'm really bad at words today. Like, I don't know what's going on. Ooh, ah, uh, 
The next thing I see is the sticker. Oh my gosh, it's a Maleficent sticker. <gasps> Dude, it's a Maleficent sticker. I'm not gonna, I don't want to use this, I'm really scared. Um, so it's for glass things, I assume. Um, I'm sorry, I, I collectible vinyl stickle stickers, Maleficent by Piper Cute. I am assuming Piper Cute has a lot of cute stuff because I really love this. Um, it's a vinyl sticker, so. I don't know what I'm gonna put it. Maybe my laptop. I really want to put stickers on my laptop, but we'll see. And it's Maleficent. She's oh, dude, dude. I can't. Oh my gosh. It's an art print. Do you guys know how much I love art prints? Like it's my favorite thing. Let me just see who did this. Um. A gorgeous original Snow White inspired art print by Lizelle Smith from the Imaginarium of Miss Smith, exclusive to the bookcase. This is so cute. Like, this is so beautiful. Like, can you see this? This is the cutest thing. Like, do you think I can frame it? I think I'm gonna get a frame or something. This is so cute. Oh, it's beautiful. I really, really love artwork. Oh, this is gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> like, where can I put it where it's safe in this, in this bookshelf? Okay. Then we get to the exciting part. The part we've been, all been waiting for. The book. So it, just, it has a sticker on that says, Happy Reading. And I'm so excited. Like... Do you guys know how little I actually go buy books these days? Like, I rarely get out. Like, I, <laughs> I'm always at home or at school, so I don't, I don't really go to bookstores much. So I don't really know what is in or anything. <laughs> but oh, now I'm excited. I'm really excited. It is The Cruel Prince by Holly Black. Um, I, I've never heard of this. Although I really wanted to read Holly Black. Like, I have a few Holly Black books, but with Cassandra Clear. Like, I didn't have a Holly Black book on her own. So, I'm really, this is really cool. Um, I'm just gonna read the back so we get the basic idea. I, no, I think I'm gonna open it first because. <laughs> I'm, I'm just really happy. I'm really excited. Like, this is the coolest thing. And I love the big books because I feel like they're easier to read, if that makes sense. Like, the bigger books. Um, but anyway, so it says, um, One terrible morning, Jude and her sister see their parents murdered in front of them. The fearsome assassin abducts all three girls and brings them to the world of fairy, where Jude is installed into the royal court. Mocked and tormented for being merely mortal, Jude soon realizes that to survive in this treacherous, dangerous new world, she needs to be as smart, cunning, and deceitful as the Fae themselves. So it's about the Fae, and that's amazing because I, I really, really, really love um, mythical creatures and things. So this is really cool. This is really cool. Like, I'm really, really happy. It's definitely worth the money. <laughs> like, I would buy this box, like, every month now because I really like this. And the fact that it has new books is just amazing <laughs> to me because I can't go to bookstores anymore. So I really, really like this. Yeah. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and thank you for being on my channel. Sorry that I never upload anymore. <laughs> um, and 
go check out the bookcase. This is not sponsored. I'm just saying I really like this. So go check them out. Um, I'll put, put their link in my bio. And yeah, so like if you like this video and you want to do want to see more unboxings of things. And subscribe if you want to see more of this inconsistent face because I forget to upload um, but yeah thanks for watching and I hope you have a good day bye